Saw you there by the counter, looking flash. Thought I'd walk up to you. I was out with my buddies, talking trash with nothing to do. I got up from the table, adrenaline, started walking to you. Lincoln's Lilac has picked out the perfect spot to plant. Already he smells. Yeah, it's gonna be nice. Are you ready? Done here. What? Drooling? Oh no, did you see the barrels in here taking up with you too? So it's very special. First things first, it is Monday and this is just a special treat. Kristen always has her, um, well, she had her class for, for work for the past, like, what, year? Tonight's the first night that we don't, that she doesn't have that in a long, long time. So it's a very special treat. You see Bear, how special he's being? Bear, what are you doing? Why are you sleeping? It's daytime. Um, anyways, so she took a little nap. And now we have a special journey to go on. We are going to plant a special bush, special bush. for Lincoln. Let me. I'll show you. Gonna, let me show you. Bear, are you going to? Are you going to help with some yard work? Bear, I said, are you going to help with some yard work? Okay, bye. Bear, get up. Do stuff. It's about right here, right outside his window. Far enough away from everything that it doesn't. Far enough away that it doesn't interfere with anything. Okay. Like right here. Like, Sounds pretty stay. good. Sounds pretty good. Okay. America. America. Okay. Here I go. Lincoln's lilac. Mm -hmm. Lincoln. Did, did Grandma tell you how far? Nope. Hello, worms. Up it up with you. Ta da, Lincoln's lilac. It's for Lincoln. I'm a little bit concerned because Kyle is good at many things, but something he's not always good at is taking care of yard work. What do you talk? What do you. Spring cleaning in winter. That was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. I burnt some hair on my <laughs> No, I got some of my hair singed off. You do it looks like you're doing a little dance. It's like, oh no, it's not straight. Huh? Sorry, Mr. Worm. I'll be out of your way in a minute. You have a good smell here. Does it smell lilac-ish? It was more like the lackish when the. Uh, did you like how I said that? Like yeah, that was weird. When the blossoms come, but I. You're a blossom. Think maybe a little bit. Yay, Lincoln's lilac! Oh, hi, Mr. Worm. Yay, Lincoln's lilac. Alright, putting some water on Lincoln's lilac. Hopefully it grows. Mm -hmm. Yay, Lincoln's Good lilac. Good job. You're Yay. Good job. Okay, Lincoln, you can come out now. Your lilac is planted. Maybe that's what he was waiting for. You can come on out now. So now that you have your own very lilac. Lincoln's lilac. I think that's what he's waiting for. Yeah? All right then, come on out. Ugh. In other news, actually, well, my shirt, this is like my favorite shirt. Mm -hmm. no, it's, I like it it's this time of year now that we can finally dress warm. Okay. And you're bursting out of that shirt. That's not, listen, Lincoln, your mom's running out of clothes, okay? <laughs> so, yeah, we, uh, my grandma has a lilac bush and she offered mm -hmm. to give us some, like a start of it, so, we thought better time now than to plant and call it Lincoln's Lilac. Mm -hmm. And that, that, just as we have planted that, just as we have planted that tree in the ground and it'll blossom, Lincoln 
will also blossom alongside his lilac. It's special. <laughs> it's just, today was a special treat. Um, it, it's been a, a, it's been a, over a year since you've been home on a Monday night. Pretty much. I mean, like, yeah, without the exception time. of a couple, a couple weeks times here, here and there. But like, it's kind of weird having you here. No, it's nice. It is nice. You don't want me to go away? No, I don't. It's nice. It's a special treat. Thanks. It really is. I made sure to have supper ready when you, when you, got, when you got home. You know, I, we had our, my famous tacos. But, yeah, so very good. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah, you guys, I know. I'm, I know a lot of you have been commenting. I check in every morning to see if you had the baby today, you know. So we're, people keep asking me at work, what's he waiting on? What's going on? Are you just going nuts? I'm going... Yep, <laughs> could be any day now, kind of thing. So, um, but it's like it's really nice. Is each well, May eleventh is next Friday, not this coming up Friday, but next Friday. And so, trying to plan things for every day to look forward to, to kind of get through mm -hmm. the next couple weeks. Mm -hmm. And I know I keep in my head, and here's where my problem is: I keep thinking that like, you know how. I, Amazon you order something and if you get prime it's obviously two-day shipping obviously we forgot to order Amazon prime with Lincoln we Indeed. forgot Indeed. but um, but um if you don't order prime it'll say like expected delivery guaranteed delivery by blank so I keep looking at May 11th like the guaranteed day like if he's not here before then well then darn it it's gonna be the 11th but that's not true and I think I have to start preparing myself for the idea that he won't it's not like, it's the 11th, time for Lincoln, kind of thing, like, because in my mind, I keep going, okay, it's 10 more days right now. Mm -hmm. Isn't that freaking crazy? Yeah. It's 10 days until the due date. Yeah. 10 days. Is it really? Tomorrow's May. Oh. It is 10 days until Lincoln's due date. Oh so, I keep telling myself, 10 more days, that means only so, so, so many more school days, but it's like, wait a minute, the 11th could he come here. And he's still not here, so I gotta start mentally preparing. Like yeah. it could be longer. It's good to that. it's good to do that. I was gonna has I was scheduled for an OB appointment tomorrow, but they had to reschedule it. So I was gonna talk to my doctor about maybe um, maybe scheduling an induction after induction into the Thane House. Yes, well, I talked to a nurse today, and well, he's a guy nurse, and his wife and is a not a guy. Usually, how it works. Yeah. Usually not. And they have three babies, and they were all induced. How long? Far long? Like around their due date. Oh, I I, we can almost have like an induction day. We're like, it's like <laughs> that would be pretty special if it was like everything was checking out fine with his, you know, everything, heart rate, size, whatever. And we'd be like, you see him on Friday. How special would that be if we schedule it for the eleventh? Mm -hmm. That way, we go to bed knowing the tenth. To be able to go to bed. Knowing that the next day you're gonna meet our son, or that unless labor at last 24 hours. And um, well, I'm just saying, like, yeah. it, like I talked back back in vlog, uh, vlogs vlogs past about wanting that excitement again, like we were a kid on Christmas Eve, mm -hmm. where you just could you're so excited that you just couldn't fall asleep. All you wanted to do was fall asleep so tomorrow could be here. Mm -hmm. How special would that be if we knew for sure that May 11th we are having Lincoln? Either you know, so like. That would be a f pretty special thing. Yeah. So we, I don't we know. Can, we can always ask. We, we can, can always ask. And I, and I know, obviously, it's the doctor's recommendation. And like, Indeed. because of the due date being a non exact science at all, it's like, well, what if he's not ready on May 11th? You know, so it's, it's one of those things where we just kind of have to go with the information that we're given and, and make the best choice. Mm -hmm. But can't lie, that would be pretty special. Yeah. We'll yeah. work with it. We'll work with it. He's, he'll be here and, and, um, and if I'm off for a couple of days before he comes, um, can kind of get things. You can be surprised by supper being ready and stuff. That'd be pretty nice. Yeah. So yeah. Anyway, we're gonna continue on doing our daily ritual now, which is going on a brisk walk. Yay, brisk walk! And uh, try and get this baby up out of here. Try and get things moving. I better go to the bathroom first. Yeah, you probably should. So, anyways, thanks for checking in. No baby today, obviously, but uh, maybe tomorrow. Or maybe yes. the next day. I don't know. Yes. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Thanks for watching, guys. Find your gift. Share with the world. And remember, you are worth it. See you tomorrow. Whoa! I almost fell apart.